Today we're here at Sunset Beach in Vancouver, downtown Vancouver. It's on the West End. It's on Beach Avenue in between Thurlow and Butte. The address, if I was to guesstimate, it would be in the 1100 block of Beach Avenue right here in downtown Vancouver. And as usual, we're doing review on the beach volleyball courts here at Sunset Beach. This beach volleyball court, there's only one here, and it's predominantly run by the local residences here at downtown West Side, particularly a gentleman, an Englishman by the name of James. He comes here almost every day, it's sunny, and sets up this beautiful volleyball net and lines, and he'll bring all his uh, cha uh, lawn chairs uh, the foldable beach chairs and for everybody to have a seat and enjoy the, the beautiful weather and play some beach volleyball. So if you're ever at sunset, be sure to connect with my buddy James here and he'll gladly allow you to play in this court. It is pretty, I would say, more intermediate level here typically because there's only one court. So they typically play two on two. Uh, maybe on occasion four on four. So this beach volley beach area here is absolutely gorgeous. You have the uh, Burrard Street Bridge there on the backdrop. Furthermore, over there you've got the uh, the boats that can take you to Granville Island and Kitsilano area. So from here you can take a ferry, a really tiny. A taxi like water taxi I think it's only a few bucks to take that'll take you to Granville Island so if you're staying in downtown you don't have to take a taxi cab on top of the the Broad Street Bridge you can just take the water taxi and it'll take you right across the Granville Island and I think it takes you to uh, Olympic Village as well there's a few different stops that it, it makes and I think it's very affordable it's only a couple bucks or so something like that uh, this is the seawall he the the seawall um, bike and, and running system or something like that they call it. Uh, if you go in this direction here, this is the eastbound direction. This will take you uh, around all the way to uh, Science World, like around Chinatown is. So you can uh, ride your bike, rollerblade or jog all the way to Science World for, right from here. If you go in the westbound direction here, you'll end up in English Bay. Now, English Bay, there's two volleyball courts there as well. Uh, I'll show you that in another video. It'll take you to English Bay. You'll have uh, Denman Street there. It's another like restaurant entertainment district right here in downtown. And then you keep on heading west along the seawall here and it takes you to Stanley Park. Right when you hit Stanley Park uh, along the seawall, you'll hit uh, tennis courts. There's a bunch of tennis courts there, so if you play tennis, uh, definitely. Uh, it's, it's only about a kilometer and a half away from, from Sunset Beach here. Uh, in the westbound direction along the seawall, you hit the tennis courts. And then another about flock westbound, or very close to the tennis courts, you have, uh, there's a park area there. I think that's called Second Beach. There's a, there's a swimming pool area there as well, a very big swimming pool. And then there's Third Beach as well, uh, where people go and hang out. It's, Third Beach is more of a quieter beach, if you like a little bit of quiet and serenity. Again, you'll hit all of these areas that I'm mentioning just by either walking, running, rollerblading, or biking along the seawall in the westbound direction, right from the starting point of Sunset Beach, if this is where you're starting. When you look uh, across the water here, that side there is Kitsilano. 
every year there's a fireworks here, the Symphony of Fire, and you can see the fireworks right from this beach. It's right in front of English Bay, and yet it's visible from this beach. And it's also visible from Kitsilano, and it's also visible at Spanish Banks and Locarno, albeit when you get that far, it, it gets a little bit small. And when you look on this area over here, this is uh, on, on, on the other side of the Burrard Street Bridge, you see all those things down there. That is uh, like those, those yellow signs, and maybe you can see the public market there. That is a Granville Island. And Granville Island is a pretty nice area to go and visit. Certainly great for tourists. Lots of arts kind of uh, venues there. And you know, there's uh, theater sports there for comedy and what have you. Uh, lots of great places to eat as well. And again, you can take the Falls Creek ferries that can take you there for a couple of bucks. So you can just hop on the water taxi here and go over to Granville Island for a visit. Also, where the Falls Creek Ferry sign is, around that area is a designated dog off-leash beach. So if you have a dog that loves the water and loves to just run around the water and is friendly with other dogs, that would be the place to take them. You can have the dog off leash and just absolutely enjoy the beachfront right there, their very own dog beach. Another great thing about Sunset Beach here is the fact that they have easy parking right here. There's tons of parking here. I'm unsure how much it costs to park here. Also, if you like, there's a lot of uh, street parking. If you're lucky, there are some free street parking in the area as well. Uh, so you just drive around, look for the sign. It's usually two hours. Uh, and, and now after a certain time, it, it's free unlimited overnight. So you just, I think it's after six. Or I think it's after six, then it, it's, you can park the whole night or something like that. Just make sure to read the sign. Beware, uh, a lot of the signs here say with permit, those uh, parking area with permit are only for residences of this area. So if you see ex uh, with, you know, a, a parking with permit, uh, you must be a resident here and have a special sticker on them. Uh, stay away from those or you'll get a ticket. Maybe you might even get towed. One thing that's really good about here is you've got uh, the concession right here. Uh, they have they serve all sorts of different foods from hamburgers hot dogs they even have kombucha here and your whole host of different kinds of ice cream there's also a bathroom here male and female and they're both wheelchair accessible also there's a water fountain and there's also a wash station just uh, an area for you to go and clean up after hanging out in the sun so you can wash all the the dirt off you before you jump into your car there's also the Sunset Beach Park where you can go and play soccer, uh, throw a football, frisbee, or if you have your own grass volleyball system, you can set up grass volleyball there. So all in all, I would say the Sunset Beach Volleyball Court area here is fantastic. The sand is good. It, some areas are a bit shallow. Uh, also, it is a bit rocky at some parts. You know, you got some, um, you know, wood every now and then, and, and you know, some bigger pebbles like this. So it, it's okay. If I rate it uh, from one to ten, ten being the best, I would give this six and a half uh, for the fact that the sand is okay. There's some areas that are shallow, so you gotta, you do have to be careful. You can dive just uh, with a little bit more caution because uh, some areas are, are definitely shallower than others. Some areas are deep and you can dive with ease and safety. Sunset Beach, Beach Volleyball Court, I do highly recommend it, especially on the days where there are festivals in downtown, uh, such as tonight where there is the Symphony of Fire. Uh, you can hang out here, play volleyball, and afterwards hang out until the fireworks. Uh, is displayed and enjoy the fireworks. Also, there's a lot of good restaurants in the area. So if you're ever hungry, a few minutes walk in almost any direction here, except for the water, unless you wanna go fishing, 
any direction in this direction, you'll find some really good, very affordable, very authentic food from Middle Eastern to Asian to continental to burgers to poutine to fusion food. Vancouver West End has got it all. It, it's absolutely fantastic. Sunset Beach for your next beach volleyball visit, highly recommend it.